Hi, well, it's really exciting to have a place like this in San Diego. They have uh, decked out for Christmas, and it's really cool, and it's family-owned, so you can come down and support a local business. They're going to be participating in December nights, so you can go eat a lot of food at December nights and then walk down the street and come here and have some more comfort food. Take a look at what we have out on the table this morning. I thought Thanksgiving was over, but I'm so happy that it's not here at the Corner Draft House. And I have Sean Schutte, the chef here. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing great. I love the place. It looks it looks perfect. You walk in, you're immediately into the Christmas spirit. So talk a little bit about Corner Draft House. So Corner Draft House, we're here obviously on the corner of 4th and Laurel, uh, just trying to really, you know, showcase the uh, family bar feeling and really kind of embody Christmas and make sure that everybody's coming to enjoy a good Christmas feeling and, and you know, be merry and joyful. Yes, and then eat a lot of really good food. Uh, talk a little bit about what you offer here. All right, so right here's our holiday specials. We have both of our bowls, our turkey bowl and our ham bowl, you know, just kind of classic Thanksgiving dinner. And then we get kind of fun with our bar, bar options. We have our Thanksgiving grilled cheese, which is our ham stuffing, mashed potatoes, gravy, and a little bit of cranberry on the inside, and three different cheeses, and then our bobby, which is Thanksgiving dinner and a hoagie roll. Tell me the history behind the bobby. The Bobby's pretty much every year my uncle would show up to Thanksgiving with a hoagie roll for some reason, I don't know why, and would toss entire Thanksgiving dinner in the hoagie roll. It was delicious. So, you know, I had to try it, and ever since, I've been doing the same exact thing. So, so if you want to overload on some carbs, you can get, like, basically that bowl right there put onto a hoagie. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. I love it. And then you also have some holiday cocktails. Talk a little bit about these. Yeah, so we have our eggnog cocktail, a peppermint eggnog cocktail. We have our um, cranberry gingerbread uh, mule, and then the last one is going to be our gingerbread old-fashioned. Oh, that looks so cute with the toothpick and everything Absolutely. with the gingerbread man on it. Yeah. <laughs> our cocktail director, Bree, has been doing a great job with everything. So. Well, everything here looks so good, but the place just makes you happy. You walk in, and you're in the Christmas spirit almost immediately. And you have some events coming up, an ugly sweater party. Ugly sweater party. Tell us a little bit about that. So on the 21st, we're going to be celebrating the end of our 12 beers of Christmas with the ugly sweater party here at the Corner Draft House. We're going to have gifts for or awards for the best sweater, the best uh, get up and you know just come and enjoy christmas holiday spirit and just have fun what are some of the other specials you have uh some of the other specials we have we have coming up next next month uh for january we have taco takeover we're doing puppies and pints in uh okay. february so we got a bunch of the special events coming up and it's just going to continue going well i imagine that this place gets packed because everyone needs a Christmas bar and restaurant to go to. Can people make reservations, or is it first come, first serve? Uh, we do recommend reservations, but first come, first serve is, you know, if you're here and we got tables, we'll seat you. And they do have an outdoor patio as well, so there's plenty of space for everyone to come and enjoy. Jason and Lauren, I will send things back over to you, but really cool spot. I'm happy that restaurants here in San Diego are getting into the Christmas spirit. That was sure oh, is. Oh, yeah, <clears throat> and they're, they're doing it quite well. All right, thanks, Casey. Appreciate it.